what is going on boys Asian sensation back with another banger today's episode we have part two of using the dart monkey every single game until we lose a game let's see how we do if you haven't watched part one already be sure to check that out i'll uh pin that in the comment section below looks like we're playing it's dartling here dartling am i able to get a banana here we're gonna try i don't think we will but also i have no idea the dart placements we're gonna go with some whack dart placements yeah I should have started the dart, and I'm just leaking unnecessary lives. But we like to start from behind. In game, of course. Good luck, have fun. Give ourselves a little, uh, little uh, adversity to overcome here right off the rip. All right, so he's starting with an aggro dartling play. It's, it's giving dartling farm boomer, which is just cheeks and absolutely just loses as long as I can bank like round 15 or earlier. So we'll see how that goes. He's just gonna try to anti to Imagine we just gotta prevent that. So I might send him a little bit. Actually, I don't want him to upgrade his Darling. If he upgrades his Darling, it's going to be destroying the natural wounds really quickly. So I'd rather just not send. Also, let's get greedy here. We're going to just save up for a plantation. I know these pinks are going to overwhelm our lone trip dart, but let's just spike the back so we can't tell how much we're really leaking and go from there. Um, if you guys are new to the channel or just haven't done this already, make sure you hit that subscribe button for us. Helps out the channel a lot and gets us closer to hitting our goal of hitting 100,000 subscribers. All right, so he's actually stalling out these rounds. So I'm thinking he has Dartling Farm Glue or something, which is actually quite good late game. So I don't know why he started off with a Dartling. I mean, our loadout is also great late game, but I'd prefer not to take Dart Farm Super versus uh, Dartling Strat late game. We'll see. I might get a little aggro Mexico here momentarily. Let's actually do that. We're going to be aggro Mexico all of a sudden. Change up the play style because if he has Dartling Farm Glue, I don't want him to get... Like around 13 BIA. That's just not going to be fun. So we're going to send this. This should cause the revealing of his third tower or cause him to upgrade or get down another Dartling. Let's see. Also, you fools get mad at me. Oh, he has Dartling Farm Bomb. Okay, we destroyed him late game. Now we just take this late. He should layer pretty well behind, actually. We're going to Bloom Boost him. Um, oh, he went straight for a Clusty Busty. Interesting. But yeah, we destroyed this late game. So we just got to take it late. Um... And go from there. He never sent blocks or anything, so I think I'm gonna greed for a farm here. If I boost round eight, I boost round eight. I think we're gonna go with this as our jug spot. I don't know how I feel about it. I feel like this is the main jug spot. Then again, I don't really run dart on this map very often. He's not rushing, let's just farm. Oh, he sold his why would you sell your cluster, bro? You're just gonna have to get that back up. You're just gonna boost here then? Did he boost earlier? He may have boosted earlier. It's giving amateur player vibes. Like, I have a trip dart and a half. Like, I'm going to struggle to AI in this upcoming round. But there's a chance he lets us get a plantation right here. He hasn't far... Okay, there. Here comes the rush. Go like this. I... Yeah. He finally found the rush button. Nicely done. These guys on first. Our life count's actually quite healthy at the moment. Farms are okay. We're on bank pace. As long as he doesn't send region leads right here, because that could be a little problematic, we should be good. Like, Darling Farm Bomb is going to get good farms. That's inevitable. But the problem is, it's just not that great late game. Unless you have, like, infinite money. And typically you don't. He's going to let me go for a plantation here, I guess. I have no lead popping power. But Mr. Nemi JM does not seem to care. So I guess I'll go for another farm. Hit him with a friendly face bomb so he rushes me with leads here. Because I should not be having this. Good. There you go. Now he does one well done. And then I guess our spolt spot is like here. Okay, he rushed here. We should be fine against this actually. Jug spot's quite good. So as long as I put my jug on first, this should just defend, right? Or er, no, we have to boost that. On our B. Uh it's better safe than sorry there. I should go double jug if he rushes here. He likely will. We'll just uh double jug and that should be enough. Maybe one more spolt. But I think I just plan on banking here, right? Yeah, we just bank every time. You shouldn't be able to BIA round 14. We're getting a nice little uh, round 14 bank ski. Beautiful. He's going to bank up as well. Okay, nice. We could rush, but honestly, priority should just be getting a BIA. So, we'll passive up. We have the Lake Man Manage. We don't need to get any extra overly aggro plays made here. Go for a Spolt down here. Okay, he's going to rush. Camo Ceramic in there. We'll get Camo on two of these guys. That should be enough. And are we able to, so, do I have two jugs? I don't. We're going to get crazy here, though. That was really greedy. Round 16 BIA, though. I mean, I think we kind of needed to make a play like that. 
Okay. He's going to rerush. It's just a boost spot. Oh, yeah, 100%. First, first. That defends. I mean, he burned a balloon boost. It's fine. Now, a rerush around 18 could be a little sketchy. He just BIA'd. I don't think he'll rush. I think I maybe just have to boost round 18 here to a Moab, right? He's going to send one. No way he doesn't. Maybe not. Okay, no Moab coming our way, but we're dying to AI right now. Okay, we're good. I'm just sniffing out a Moab. I don't want to send him a Moab. Like I said, I like Dragon Force defense, but I need to just focus on farming right now, I think. Or sending Eco Blooms to Force run, or Force defense. That's fine. But I don't think it's worth sending Moabs. Is he sending those lights or are those natural lights? I think he's sending those, right? Yeah, he is. Let's go for another jug. Just defends. He's getting kind of... Oh, what is that placement? He's getting kind of aggro all of a sudden. Double jug should defend here. 69 lives. That's living, yeah. We're living. Okay. If B does force a lot of defense on his end. But like I said, I think we literally just need to pass him up. We'll probably get a plan or a facility around 22 and go from there. Um, I think I can go for a farm. If he sends a Moab, we can just get up a super. Placement-wise, I think I'm gonna go back. I want it to be able to hit like the end. So if I put it like here, it's gonna get blocked by balloons coming down here. But be fine. Okay, can farm on. So we pretty much just rush him like round 35 all out. He shouldn't be able to defend. And then hopefully we can defend a counter. Neither. Oh my gosh, he's dying to AI. Nope, he's good. Try this up here so we can't tell if we have viable bananas or not on that. And yeah, we are going to facility up after this round. I think keeping the BIA is fine for one more full cycle and then we'll sell it. That's the plan. He never sent me a Moab, so we still have our last boost. It's quite nice. I keep on farming, I suppose. Yeah, we'll cash this out another round. I'll have like 14k, which is enough for our plantation, obviously. Very nice. Um, do I need another jug here? Probably. Cash you out, boom. And we'll go for a triple jug. I'm gonna rush him here. Just eco balloons, but we get a boost, nice. Triple jug should handle every time of the way. Every day of the week that handles. If he sends us UMG right here though, it's not a bad play. Should force plenty of defense. I could actually send him a BFB with camos behind it. Really bold, but no, let's not do that. He's used at least one boost. Has he used two boosts? Mm, I'm not too sure. Our farms are decent though. Like we should be able to defend around 35 counter all out, I think. Roadblock is a fairly long map though. Keep that in mind. I suspect a ZMG is going to be sent our way shortly, which is when we're we're going to want our Robo like back here. That way, when it's a tech terror, it's going to be able to spread all the BFBs at once. As soon as the ZMG is turning to BFBs, the tech terror will one shot as long as they're in range. So our farms are really strong here. Got oh, two more eco here. Looking quite favorable for the boys here, for Team Dart. Uh, I think we are going to need slightly more defense here. I'd like to conceal the fact that we have super just a little longer if possible. We'll go quad jug to be extra safe. I think jug micro I probably defend here. Is he good? He might die to AI. A lot of camos. Or is he fine? Like that. Should be able to fit you. Nice. Expecting a ZMG. Okay, he sold his BIA. Oh, we can definitely kill him with camo ceramics here. If he just sent a ZMG, which I expect he will. These camos are going to sneak by because you're not going to have extra money to defend here. So three, two, one, send. Just three. Should do the trick. That should be GG. Yeah, he's dead, right? Oh, he went for the laser cannon. Is that enough, though? Oh, he leaked to 10. Okay, so my, like, $3,000 rush just was for nothing. But no ZMG. This dude is being so passive. My oh, man's is passive McGee over here. What is going on? All right, well, let's... I mean, I'd probably keep this up to its full cycle, right? Okay, now he's sending. Well done. He needs to be sending infinite ZMGs now. This is his best chance of winning, is sending ZMGs for the rest of the game and just accepting the fact that he's going to have trash farms. So we're going to tech terror this. I guess we can sell this now. Yeah. And this will be just a little tech terror spot. 
that you just want this to be BFB is right when it's by my Robo Monkey. Not before, not after, else that's gonna mess up with the Tech Terror. Ooh, that was such a greedy farm. What am I doing? Uh, I don't have other bananas on it. I know, it's fine. Okay, we're gonna move this to last now because we actually don't wanna... Okay, let's get this. Yeah, this is kind of sketchy. I think we're good. I am gonna Tech Terror this. And then I think we go for permanent defense. Yeah, we'll be able to afford this here. And that should just clear all the BFBs. Beautiful. And now let's get Vibe Bananas and keep farming. Are we going to get the Tech Terror ability back? Maybe. Definitely not, actually. What? <laughs> let's just farm on here. I'm just going to ignore that for a little bit. Farm on. And let's go like this. This should defend that Moab. And I think this is all the farms. I Maybe I should go permanent defense now. Well, this one's already pretty far. Yeah, this is sketchy, bro. He's playing it well now. He's sending the infinite ZOMGs now, which is the correct play. So, nicely done, sir. We're going to tech Terry this in a sec. Yeah, yeet. And now I think we go permanent defense. If we can defend this without tech tearing, that'd be great. My farms aren't amazing, but neither are his. I think a robo. This should just defend straight up, right? Is he sending camos? That's AI. This just defends, right? These, this is a sub 330 or sub round 30 ZMG. Yeah, we're good. Now we're good. But these ZMGs he sends now are going to be stronger. We are going to want more camo section just in case he sneaks any camos or tries to. Uh, let's just go for more robos here. And then we are going to want to prep a fan club. Because these are going to be getting strong where fan club is going to be a nice little um, added thing to defend. I think I could kill him with an all-out. I don't think he could get up defense quick enough to defend. But it's also quite risky. I mean, I'm just surrendering all my eco. But I think we have enough money where we can defend. Round 33, is that too early for a counter or no? I don't hate it. I have a lot of money right now. Yeah, we're going to rush as soon as round 33 hits. I'm just going to all-out. I just don't think he has enough defense prep, nor is he going to be able to get up defense quick enough don't think this guy has like s tier micro i'd be very surprised so we're just gonna go for it it's likely induces an immediate counter we should have enough jugs as well or any sort of camo counter and i think we sell the tt here it allows us to send three more zmgs yeah he's not getting up defense nearly quick enough this is a uh, see it here yeah dude why are you spamming two one darlings bro that is not gonna do it man what are you doing Oh, not like this, man. At least counter. Please. Let me defend something, please. Well, that's unfortunate. There's zero chance he defends here. Hate to break it to you, Mr. Uh, Nemi, but that's not going to do it, brother. I hate to break it to you. Even on boost, boost is not going to save you here, pal. All right. Well, we're just going to boost for fun here, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Let me again, bro. I mean, we have to keep the win streak going, so I'll play him. Good luck. Wiz keep actually like one of the best dart maps in the game. Good luck. He skips it. A game. I mean, not a bad dart map. Good DFA. Just in case he goes cover, DFA is a lot easier to use than dart farm super. Hey, okay. what did he use last game? Darting farm bomb. He might try it again on this map, I guess. Are you going to anti-stall? Whatever you think. I feel like he goes Cobra here. A lot of people love going Cobra on this map. Um, he's going heli based on that spike usage. But... Yeah, he is. Just in case. Alright. This is fine. There's no point in really sending anything here. Let's just rush our trip guard. He's going to be playing heli farm glue or heli farm NG. By the looks of it. And that's okay. I mean, we should be okay in the late game. It's just going to be whether or not he can maintain a heavy anti-stall. He's playing it flawlessly thus far. He's getting the anti-stall. He likely has heli farm blue. I've seen people use heli farm village on this successfully to beat Cobra as well. So that could be a play. Could have expected me to go Cobra. Um, Let's break his anti-stall here. I'm going to have a ego. The stall that rounds favor us. Because we should out late game any loadout he has if... It's uh, infinite money off, you know what I mean? 
Let's just chill with this and then try to get a plantation shortly. Ooh, we're gonna be leaking, leaking though. Oh well, this is a max length round four, so this is good for us. And do I spike here? Yeah, we're just gonna greet it out, man. Greet it out. So we can send a little bit just to distract his heli from everything. I don't like how I'm already up spikes and already leaked a lot. But it's the price we pay to extend the rounds out and still get a round five plantation. Like, it is what it is. He has a quad darts up now, though. He'll likely just save up for his plantation and not send me a ton of greens. But he's probably going to send blacks, right? Yeah, he's going to send greens. Okay. We just go strong, strong. We'll work on getting up a third one here. This is 0-2. This should do the trick. I don't think anything really penetrates through this, right? In game. Yeah, we've been chilling. Now we can get aggro. I don't hate going for a third trip dart here either. Just because it's gonna preserve our life down a little bit. I don't really plan on farming too soon, right? Yeah, let's go for a third trippy. Never mind, he stopped sending. We're good. So it is heli farm glue as expected. I think we send a massive rush next round to get a boost out of him. We shouldn't need to bloom boost it because he's gonna want a plantation up right here. He has the money to plantation. Yep, there it is. And that's fine. I think. Getting a boost out of him here is great. Sure, I could have went for farm. Not a bad play either, but just get the boost here. The boost. Yeah. Okay. I want to go for another farm here, but he's probably going to counter with yellows of his own. Actually, okay, here's what we're going to do, boys. Call me crazy. I think this forces farm cell. Infinite yellows here. I think this forces farm cell. Am I a psycho? Or does this just kill? GG? Yeah, GG, man. Wait. Yep, sold farm. Nice. Why are you going for glue? Okay, well, he has zero farms. This is amazing. I need to be able to defend leads here, though, if he sends leads. Which he likely will. My farm suffered because of that, but so did his. Okay, no leads. There they are. I have a spolt if I see any balloon here. Not okay. There it is. That up to defend, right? Yeah, my farms kind of suck. He's like all outing though, bro. Dude, I don't know if I should have sent that rush. Like, I'm not even on bank pace. Oh, I'm kind of broke, which I think favors him. Unfortunately, I think we send a mass. Let's try to get a second boost out of him here. Are you boosted round eight? Yeah, okay. He's gonna go for a razor rotors. We're just gonna eco. I think we can play mix eco dart here. He's dead to AI, bro. Yeah, you're dead to AI. The two... This is a very difficult AI map, dude. Four lives. Okay, he's fine. Oh, uh, let's keep sending, bro. He, AI is tough here. This is a boost spot for sure. You have to boost. Right? You have to boost. You are one life. Yeah, let's just keep the heavy pressure on him here, dude. This is not an easy map. He's still farming. I like getting eco here. Maybe some... Oh, this is too late to layer. There's like no balloons on the screen other than mine. I think round 5th... AI should just kill him, bro. I refuse to believe he won't leak a single life here. Yeah, you're dead. What? How is he soloing this without leaking? Okay, we force a rotor, so that's great. I'm okay boosting. I have 800 eco. This is good. Mix eco will work here. He's gonna rush. Let me just boost here. Every time. Every time we just boost that. We're good to go. For a rerush, we can ODS. Still have two more boosts, which is awesome. Check the rerush, sell a couple trips, and my top spolt, and we'll be good to go. Go for a farm here, why not? Okay. Round 18, we should be able to kill him. Oh, he's getting ready. Oh, that's not what you want to go for, though. You need that rotors up. This... These eco balloons will just kill. The AI, this is way too difficult of a map for that to solo, bro. GG. There's zero chance this solos. I will bet a hundred dollars this does not solo. Yeah, you get up enough. Yeah, GG. It's so tough to play low lives on a game, bro. Like if if you're playing the one life game mode on that, it's so hard. In game. All right, inlets. Um. I mean, dart farm super, but I just have to play extremely high eco. There's just not enough farm spots. I mean, dart sniper super could work. 
Oh, this is sketchy, bro. Maybe Dart Sniper Ace, low key. I don't hate it. I mean, there's just not enough farm spots where I'd feel comfortable going farm. So we're going to go Dart Sniper Ace. I don't know how well this is going to go. But, I mean, there's only four farm spots. Farm's just not that good here. With Dart, at least. He's going Cobra. Okay. This is a really weird spot. I have a very odd strategy to play against Cobra. It's likely Cobra Bomb Mortar, right? So as long as he doesn't fully anti-stall, I should be good to go. As long as I can get one sniper farm off, it should be in business. I feel like I have fun. Not a matchup you play very often at all, but we're going like, to give it a go. Also, I'm probably going to want to go for an early spolt. Where am I placing that? Maybe I just go double trip dart. We'll see. He's not sending. He's not anti-stalling. So already in a great spot for us. He's playing quite poorly. If he was playing the best cobra possible round four would have started two seconds ago so we're getting a lot of extra money due to his misplays early because you with cobra dude you want your opponent to have as little money as possible that way your adjustment or your offensive push rushes are enhanced or strengthened and obviously that's not the case like round four is starting like 15 seconds later than it normally would in an anti-salt game almost 15 not quite but still really good spot for us we can just get five or six hundred eco honestly i think we can get 600 eco and just chill but this is looking like a 600 eco pre-round 13 get the sniper farm like round 15 and then we're good to go because once you have a sniper farm you can always sell out for a fan club and the fan club should defend any rush up until round 22 and then round 22 obviously you have to ground zero for anything that a fan club can't handle so it's just a really good spot it, he likely has bomb as his fourth or his third that's fine we're gonna keep that in last i think that's fine and then first here and we could do some damage with some blocks on this upcoming round. I don't hate it. He's not floating a lot of cash. We're going to bloom boost this. This will be pretty effective. And then I don't... Yeah, I don't really want to go for a spolt for some reason. Oh, he's going for a double tap. Interesting play. I think this is all the blacks I want to send because I want to get back to ecoing with some greens here. The live count's looking amazing for us. Very good. And our eco's also looking really good. 450, 460 eco going around seven. It's a great spot for us. And he's going to start leaking a lot here. My boy, he's going to go for the Bernie stuff here. A little late to get the burn dog up. I'm surprised it didn't leak that much to my blacks. I guess I didn't send enough. I don't know. We're at the 500 eco mark. Yeah, we can definitely get to 600. Really juicy spot here for us. I mean, I could go for a spolt down low. Yeah. I mean, it works. He's going to send a big rush here. This is fine. We can't afford to boost here. We'll just do this. This should do the trick, right? Or am I going to need another one? I might need another one. Yeah. Um, This defends, right? We're going to leak a little bit, but it's okay. I mean, it's a good spot spot, right? It's just a little late in the map. We'll go to 600, like I mentioned. I think that's a good spot. He also has plenty of eco. This dude probably has like 600 eco of his own. Kind of nuts. Send blacks. Blacks will honestly still be effective. There's the revealing of his third tower. We expect that. We're going to hide our sniper as best as we can here. I guess that's going to be like... There's no real spot to hide it. But this works. He can't, he can't tell what upgrades are on that. It's hidden with the name bar. He's sending regions. Regions won't do anything. Oh my gosh, he's still ecoing. Bro is literally playing 700 eco cobra. This is nuts. Do I go for another spolt here? I mean, I guess. Dude, he has no money. I guess he knows I don't have money either, so he can afford to do this. Not a terrible play. I mean, having a ton of eco with Cobra is not bad. Because eco is so much better than Cobra farms. So he's in a decent spot, honestly. Because now he can just start Cobra farming. The nice thing is though, I have 600 eco and I can get a Cobra or a Sniper farm like round 14, which is quite good. We'll end up selling a bunch of stuff. I'd like to sell my Spolt as opposed to my Trip Darts because my Trip Darts can help with Moabs. Uh, the Jugs are the Spolts don't really. Yeah, look at him farm now. He's farming with them Cobras. I expect round 16 adjustment. I mean, we can counter adjustment. It's a little difficult though because like the Jug Spots aren't great. That's the only worry I have here. But he's going to Eco. I mean, this is okay. Should be fine here. This is a little sketchy though, not gonna lie. 
Yeah, dude. This defends, but I really want to get up my sniper farm, but I can't really afford to sell these things yet. I mean, just max e going, bro. Let's go for it. Okay, right, there we go. Send him a little rush just to force his cluster. There it is. Nice. And he's selling? What is he selling? Is he rushing me or no? That's just AI, right? Is he ecoing right now? No, he's not. Any offensive push rush is such an easy defend because we have the fan club, right? But is he going to adjust round 18? I think so. He probably has like 800 eco, dude. That's good. 800 eco is really strong here. Against adjustment, I guess I'm going to need to get... Well, we're going to need a second one of these guys anyways here. Like this. We'll put him on last in case he layers a Moab or something. This is a little sketchy. Our opponent's actually pretty good. He's playing quite well. He just didn't anti-stall, but other than that, he's played well. If I see any Moab... Okay, let's just get FMJ anyways. He is adjusting now. There's one adjustment up. Okay. I mean, we're just going to go for this. Fine. I am going to have to fan club against a BFB if he sends one, but that's okay. Yeah, now we just kind of chill here. We can get some eco if we want to. I don't hate it. I think we just chill with two sniper farms, right? Could put them. I think, yeah, we just need to save up for the fan club right now. Do that. He might do like a heavy adjustment with a BFB send as well, because that's going to really throw off my hours, right? Okay, sending me a ZOMG, that's the dumbest thing you could possibly do. Ground zero exists, buddy. That's not going to work out very well. I can afford a GZ. Alright, well. <coughs> um, There's fan club here. That's fine. Like, this is his all out here, so we just defend this, we win. It's going to be a pretty easy to defend as well. Get that up. We just want to sell our sniper farms as late as possible, but it'll be a pretty easy defend. Get 0 0.50. That's actually going to help out a lot. Actually, do we even want to pop it yet? Put you on. Yeah, first. I just have to put him on first. This is fine. Sell you. This is defending, right? Yeah, we're defending. Don't have to sell quite yet. We double GZ, we double GZ. This is the top guy. Um, get you guys both on strong. And that should pop it any second now. Yeah, I'm just gonna play this extra safe. There we go. Dude, you have no money. There's no way this works. I just take it late. He has, he's broke. Okay. Um, He's just ecoing, dude. I just go back to sniper farming. What is going... This is such a weird game, bro. See, now if he sends a BFB, it's actually kind of a tough defend. They don't have a fan club prepped. Dude, this dude's just dead doing all out, but that's way too risky, isn't it? He has no money, dude. It's so risky, though. Because, like, can I even defend a counter very well? I mean, kinda. I'm gonna do it. Bro, Is he's literally just max equaling. This just kills. This just kills. Any counter, I can afford fan club here. He does not have the money to defend this. Sell those guys for the price of a GZ in case he tries all out Moabs. We have money to afford. So I expect a counter of some sort, so let's just prep a fan club. Oh, he's going for the defend. Okay, now we have to just all out. Boost. Dude, he's gonna defend. What am I doing? I played like an idiot. Maybe camos, I guess. Really? Yeah, we lose, bro. I played like an idiot. What am I doing, man? No, we're good. We're good. We're good. Are we good? Camos? Camos, camos, camos? Defend? Is he good? 
Oh my gosh. What is this game? Can I defend this? I think I'm dead. Yeah, we're dead. GG, man. I don't know why I all outed. Or is he good? Gotta be good, right? I have to try something here. He still has a boost. Let's try one more. I mean, there's technically still a chance, but he just more selfless. Go, 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 go. There's a chance, there's a chance, there's a chance, there's a chance. Choke it, choke it, choke it, choke it, choke it. Dude. There's a chance, one pink. Yes! Oh my god! How did we win the <laughs> We literally tied and we won! Oh my god! Yo, that's that's a definition of never give up until it's done, bro. Let's go, bro. Yo, that was wild. That's actually unreal, man. We're a dog. Absolute dog. Okay, we found him again. This guy is actually pretty good. His record shows that he's bad, but he's actually pretty good. Inlets again, bro. I don't think I can run it back. That's too sketchy, bro. I don't like dart on that map at all. Swamp is amazing. You can go, bro. Go Cobra on Swamp. I got you. You are getting clapped by the big sensei's DFA on Swamp and Donk. Hey, good luck. Have fun. Insane match, dude. That was one of the closest games I've ever played. It's nuts. Is this going to be Heli Farm Glue? Potentially. No, it's Cobra again. Okay, he's going to the non-anti again. Kind of whack. All right, well, we just farm here. How do we play this? I mean, I could just bank, right? We didn't have farms last game, but we had Dart, obviously. I think the approach is... You can either mix eco or bank. Both work. I mean, we destroy Cobra on paper. Gotta execute. 55, pretty standard. Get the trip Dart. From there. Max stalled. Rounds one and two. Quite favorable. Dirt Dalt. Alright. And yeah, man. He just plays really heavy ego. Cobra. It's interesting. Quite interesting. Okay. Get you on last. I mean, I'll just double... Well, yeah. I think I have to just double trip. And these rounds are stalling out, so like I don't really need to try to like break his anti-stall. I mean we can round four, but am I able to greed this? I really want to greed here for plantation. I think we have I think it's the right play. So that's what we're gonna try to do. I'm also gonna try to send a little bit at the end of this round to get his cobras to shoot my pink balloons and not the AI, and hopefully that extends the round. But I think the mortar spot's good enough where he should be able to anti-stall this round. Yeah, see that was a quick that's gonna be a quick round four. Unfortunately. But we got a round four plantation, which is awesome. Really good spot. Put you on first now. And do we go for a Spoltz? Yeah, I guess Spoltz to play if he's going to play Heavy Eco. Right? I think Bloom boosting green. Uh, he's going to send a big rush right here, isn't he? Let's greet it. Go for the farm. Put on first. Gonna leak a lot here. Okay, our farms are great. I don't care that we only have 273 eco. This is really good for us. So this is gonna bait. He's gonna send me a big green rush, right? If I can just get two plantations before round 10, I think we're in a good spot. So let's just aim for that. He's not eco, which is very suspicious. Okay, here comes a huge rush. I don't remember the jug spot quite, but I think this works. I think this might be it. Pretty sure this is it. It's around that area is the best jug spot. This just defends. We can try blocking his anti on this round, but I don't think we'll be able to. The mortar spot's just cooking now. But yeah, we get around eight plants. He's just ecoing super heavily. I mean, that's his play style. We picked up on that. We're okay against it. I, I honestly should be able to get another 1-0 farm before round 10, which is so good. Plus, we have all of our spikes. But I think we just bank, like, round 12. Like, if he's going to play heavy eco, like, he's not going to have money to punish the round 12 bank. You know what I mean? So we'll do that. He's gonna send a big yellow rush right here, right? Yep. Kind of understand his play style now. Like I picked up on exactly what he's gonna do and when he's gonna do it. See, look how massive this yellow rush is. Which is good. This is I'm glad that he's sending this much. Because the result is just gonna be me 
getting a bank without being able to get punished. Okay, he's gonna send this. You're on strong, get you on first. Oh, strong, strong, strong. Okay, we're spiking that. That is, we do not want a bunch of regions here. Uh, let's just go like that. Play it extra safe, boys. And we just bank here. You can't punish that. You cannot punish that. You don't have money, bro. Where's your money to punish this? Don't have it. That's where it is. Just gonna fake a rush here. Okay, strong, strong, strong. In case he rushes here. Crypt Dart spam it out if he rushes. All right, so we got what round eleven bank. That's amazing. Like that's just winning. He's gonna rush here probably. Yep, here comes the rush. Let's see how large of a rush it is first before we do anything. Okay, first, first. Okay, there's region whites in there. Oh my gosh, bunch of regions. I mean, we defend. Um, he didn't balloon boost. Let's just get the ace down. I have like at least three k in it. Yeah. That. And this is just winning, dude. Like, how are you defending that? You're just not. GG? Oh, he afforded an impact? Oh, he sold his camo. We just send this. Let's just get his camos. <laughs> he can... What is going on, bro? We're forcing a lot of selling and rebuying. This is great. I don't care how high your ego is, bro. I have a bank. Like, this is fine. That's all I need. Because Cobra's just cheeks, bro. Cobra's trash. <laughs> I'm sorry, man. It's not good on this map. And he's out of money here. He probably sends a Moab. I mean, if I just BIA like around 20, we're fine. Which is probably what's going to happen. So if he sends a Moab, I could try to defend Boostless, but I mean, if he Bloom Boost, we just boost. If he doesn't Bloom Boost, I mean, I don't think he probably does have money for a Moab, but I'm not too worried. We're going to. We're definitely going to BIA right here. Okay. Round 18 BIA, amazing. Expect some, oh, he's got an offensive push of BFB at me. Okay, not a bad play, but I, yeah, not a bad play. I can't really, I mean, I can. Oh, this seems like I'm gonna choke here. I think I'm, okay. I mean, we just have to think. Yeah, we have to sell it. It's so annoying, bro. Can we defend this, please? Defend, defend, defend. Okay, that ran out worst possible time. Dude, how does he have so much money? This dude just has infinite money, I swear. Okay. I mean, we just get it back up now, right? Um, maybe around 21. Bro, I don't know. I think we go for it. He's max equine, dude. Let's send it. He's gonna send another one here. Another BFP is gonna be coming. Three, two, one BFP. Yep. Okay. Just fine. We wait to sell the ODS because he's gonna send these leads behind. Right? It's fine. This one won't do anything because now look, there's a forward here and we just boost it. This is a prime spot to use boosts. Please don't run out. Oh, we're dead. Oh my gosh, we live somehow. Okay, I just have the fan club again, don't I? Dude, what is going on? This dude should not have any money. How does he have money still? Gonna be a Moab send probably. Um, this might be the weirdest Cobra game I think I've ever played. <laughs> Another BFB, stop! Enough with the BFBs, my guy. Okay, well, I should be able to defend this without doing anything other than simply fan clubbing, right? This defends. This doesn't defend. I'm quitting the game, bro. Like, please. Okay, here comes leads probably. I'll just eco. 
Maybe we just get this up. He's gonna run out of money doing this. Like, I could... Again, I think I could kill him with an all-out, but it's so risky because bro literally just defended or nearly defended my random all-out last time. He just sold some Cobras to eco even harder. Okay, well, we can get some camos by here. Just do this a few... T oh, I only have one Bloom Boost. I thought I had more Bloom Boosts. Oh, uh, we're good, right? How am I almost killing him with that? <laughs> That's crazy. Okay, how much is in the BIA? 10k? Okay, we're big chilling. This is free. Okay, we need another jug for round 25, though. Let's get that up. Also, I think I can sneak more camos by. Try it. A lot of compact balloons on this round. I don't care that I'm burning a lot of money on these camos because it might force a mortar stall. If it does, I mean, that's a win in my book. Okay, hold on. Oh my gosh, I was about to die to that. I was about to fan club, but I had 30k in savings. Also, someone always comes in, oh, Ethan, how? Why don't you ever catch on your BIA when you sell it? It auto collects when you sell it, bozos. All right, well, we keep it going. This is gonna be the last video of this, or last game of this video because it's almost 10 p.m. and I have work tomorrow, bright and early. So we'll do a part three if I win this, I guess. That's pretty good though. Snowy Castle, kind of a sus start map as well. Only three farm spots. Racetrack is terrible for darts. Yeah. I don't know what I would have went. This is also terrible for dart. This is really bad. I mean, there's only one viable loadout here, and it's dart sniper ace here. This is the only viable loadout. The issue is, oh my gosh, this is so bad actually. He's gonna go. I think I just lose, man. He's gonna go attack Ninja Village and then it just beats me. Right? I mean, I could maybe go Super instead of Ace. Yeah, I think we just have to try Super, bro. Because I think it'll fare better late game, right? Than Dark Sniper Ace. Because it's gonna go to like round 35. He's anti. He has attack Ninja Village, bro. This is so tough. It's the meta on this map. Like, we just have to somehow play this flawlessly and have, like, infinite money for round 35. So I guess that's what we're going to have to do, man. I think we play it quite heavy eco, because I'd rather have eco... Like, I think we play, like, 2,000 eco with sniper farms, honestly. Oh, he's going mortar. What is this? He does not have Ninja Sniper or Ninja... Tech village what does he possibly have here ninja mortar super maybe i don't i'm a bit puzzled bro i don't know what loadout this man's could possibly have but i feel like we're in a good spot once i see mortar hmm it could be anything it's got to be paired with like ninja it could be ninja glue mortar right there's potential for that. Let's send him some pinks. I need to see his other towers. It's got to be ninja. Yeah, it's ninja. Okay, ninja, mortar. Oh, man. It's probably glue then. Yeah, it's a good strategy. It really is. Um, I mean, we just have to take it late, right? Yeah, this is a kind of a tough matchup just because he has triple stall, right? Like he has the Sabu, he has Glue, or he probably has Glue. It's the best strategy you can bring, is Ninja Glue Mortar. That's the best strategy you can possibly bring here. That's what I'm expecting to be up against. And it, like I said, it is a good strategy. I will not take that away from him. Um, I guess we go for a Spolt. The Spolt spot seems so trash, but we're going to try it anyways. These blacks are going to be pretty problematic for him as well. It may bait... A glue usage. Let's see. I mean, I'm fine sending a bunch of blocks. If I can get his live count low, though, actually, then I might be able to sneak some camos through. Okay, this is good. I like the pressure we're putting on him here. He's already leaked 60 plus lives. We're able to get a solid eco. These rounds are stalling out, which is good. I think it is good that I have super here, since it's basically eco v eco, right? This is good. Oh, he's struggling, dude. He is struggling. He's got to have money for Bernie stuff, right? Yeah, there it is. Yeah, let's get one of you on strong, one on first. I think we just play like 700 eco pre-13. 
Three round 13. I think we can pull it off, honestly. The spot spot works. It's not amazing, but it works. Am I able to get lives on him here? Maybe 600 eco should be. Uh, dude, I honestly feel like I can eco harder and still be fine round 13. Risky, though. He might have Sniper as well. He could have Sniper. Which is an interesting matchup again, as well. So, it's not like a certainty that he has glue. I really don't know if he's going to have glue here. I think we'll find out pretty shortly, but... Just full cue that. Alright, we have Sniper. He's going to thumbs up, maybe. Yep, there, he's Reese. What does he have? I don't think he has Sniper. I think it's glue. I think it's going to be glue. Okay. And for any rush here, I mean, I want to get up another bolt here. I'm gonna rush, right? Or no? Strong, strong here. He doesn't have sniper. It's gotta be glue, bro. What is going on here? I mean, if he all outs, we just get a 0.50, and this defends on boost. So, don't. Oh, he has sniper as well. Yo, okay. Very interesting, boys. This is a matchup I've never played. <laughs> we can sell all these guys for roughly like 3,300. I mean, if he goes for his thing, I'll go for my thing. I think is the consensus. Just go. Should I just go for it now? I mean, 23k. Yeah, we can just go for it now. Do that. He goes for his. I mean, let's just punish with yellows. There it is. Okay. Forcing defense, that's great. Wow. This is a weird matchup, bro. I kind of like his spot, not gonna lie. But I mean, maybe I just eco, bro. Okay, I'm gonna go for two sniper farms and then I'm gonna eco like crazy. No, because the problem is that I have to defend. BFB defense are so tough with my loadout, man. It's so expensive to defend PFPs with my loadout. I literally have to get the fan club. I mean, his isn't cheap either. And I don't think I really want to send him a BFB. Sure, of course, it's some defense, but like, bro, it's tough. I, just, yeah, I literally just have to get up an $8,000 upgrade round 20, plus I have to get other darts around it. It's kind of annoying. We really have to conceal the fact that we have super though. He's gonna expect us to have ace here nine times out of 10. The super is pretty sneaky. And he's probably gonna adjust his playstyle. Like, if he assumes I have ace, he's not gonna send around 22 ZMG. If he thinks I have super, it's a little different. Um, What do I do here? Strong first. Strong last, actually. Can we get any cheeky rushes through? Like this. I mean, he's ecoing now. If I eco? Okay, let's get the 0.50. I'm gonna eco. I think I do want eco this game, is the thing. I still want to be able to afford a fan club. Okay, can I place this? Oh my gosh. Okay, let's just eco, bro. I'm gonna get my eco up. Do it. Does he have 0.50 on those? Oh, he's sending me a mullet right now, I think. I, I need to save my boost, don't I? Do I or don't I? Okay, let's just go to a thousand eco here. Going for another one. That was Nico round 19. That's good. Now we have to save it for the fan club, obviously. But we want one on last. That way you can't layer leads. And then one on strong to target the BFBs. That's the BFB. That's fine. So, yeah, we're just going to need a fan club here. And we want Razor Sharp on this fan club, or else we might die to insides. We got to be tread a little carefully here, not going to lie. I'm just gonna keep ecoing to about 6k because I know I'm gonna get a crate here any second now. And like I said, I want eco. Just eco. Okay, he's gonna eco back. Now I think I can just go for one. Go for one. That's an extra decent eco. If I sell it, I sell it, you know? Okay. Holy cow, man. This is wild. Like I said, I think 2k eco is fine. Maybe 1,500. I think that's still plenty, right? And then just focus on sniper farms. Hmm. This is going late, bro. I'll go 2k. I think 2k is fine. He's playing full passive. He just thinks I, he outlate games me. Which, I, I mean, it's such a weird matchup, bro. 
It really is just odd. Okay, is he good against AI here? There's nothing I can do, right? I mean, I could get a sneaky BFB through, right? Are we good against that? Yeah, we're good. Getting a Jug, not a bad idea either. His Bloom Buster. Like, if I send a BFB, it could just force so much to you. I just don't think I really need to. Oh, he's choking. Oh, he's good. Okay, now we focus on Cyber Corms. 2,000 equals great. We're in a great... We're going to have a lot of money here. If he sends me a BFB, I mean, I, it's not the end of the world if I sell a Sniper Farm to Fan Club. It's really not. So just keep that in mind. Once we have, like, seven of these up anyways, if I just upgrade them to 0.50, it should defend a BFB anyways, right? I don't know. That's a bit sus. All right, but... Okay, we have five of these guys. I guess I should probably focus on making sure these placements are good because we're going to have a full map of towers late game. Like, this is going late, obviously. I don't know whose position I'd rather be in. I have all my boosts here with super. It's not terrible. I'll end up getting a temple probably, right? Oh, yeah, probably. I mean, that way I've, I'm sure I don't ever die to any camos. If I don't get that up, it's a little sus, isn't it? Okay. I think I have more eco than him. Good. I hate collecting all these sniper farms though. It's kind of annoying. Sniper gang goes crazy, dude. I should probably go for one more FMJ or else we're going to struggle a little bit here, aren't we? We're going to struggle here. I think we are. E we're good. Did not need to get that up. Bit of an overreaction. It's fine though. He's selling stuff or what? No, we're good. Oh man. We're going late, bro. I'll see you guys in the late game. I don't think anything's gonna happen until like round 32. Probably. Oosh, ooh, round 30. Okay. The cripple. Okay. Watch up here, boys. I have to go for like a sun god here or something. Go, 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 go. Uh, Robo, I guess. Um, and then a few of these guys on strong here. Okay. Make sure we're good against AI here. Boost. I'm dead. Oh, we're living. That was sketch. What am I doing? I just burned a boost for no reason. Okay. Um... Where do I want to get? I'm going to go for a temple down here, I think. Oh, this is whack. Temple does not seem like the play, actually. Let's just go for sun gods here. Let's just defend. I need more sniper farms, bro. Like, no room. I want to reserve the middle area, you know what I mean? Okay, we're actually shredding. But, like I said, I'm a little sussed out by camos. A bunch of these on strong. I think someone first, though. I need someone first. Oh, man. This is kind of tough, bro. I don't want to waste space on a fan club. Yeah, let's just go for a temple down here, bro. I don't care that I'm losing money doing this. It's okay. Yeah, we're just going to get temple. Just to be safe. Beautiful. That way we don't have to worry about camos ever. And now I want to put all these guys on strong. Strong, strong. What do I rush? I guess around 40 probably rush, right? I think that's fair. I mean, this 2000 eco is really nice. He sent me like two ZMGs, so he lost 800 eco by sending those. I think. So we're already in a great spot, actually. I don't care if he has more sniper farms at this point, like... This is all the space I think I want to use for sniper farms, probably. I mean, we can go for a couple more, but not really needed. Now it's more so just prepping the defense in case he randomly rushes. Let's sync all the snipers up, maybe. Just so annoying clicking all the abilities. We need to just... They need to make a monkey farmer for sniper farms, bro. I hate manually clicking across this whole map. Do you see how close to my tower boost those flex were right there? It's so easy to accidentally make tower boost, too. Now, he has the better stall, which is very scary, but I think we can make it work. 
You do have all these guys. Oh my gosh, I'm gonna accidentally hit that tower boost. It's gonna happen, dude. Okay, strong. Gotta make sure we don't die to AI too. With all these on strong, they're gonna target Zoom Jeezy's friends. Do I even go for cripples, bro? I think I have to, but like, I have to. You know what I mean? Uh, I'll go for like eight, maybe. Like half on strong with. Uh, here's what we're gonna do. He's gonna rush here. It should be an easy defense still. Strong. Like, that's gonna immobilize that pretty well here, I think. And then we'll do first. And yeah, we go for sun gods here. Bunch of sun gods should do the trick. This is a little sketchy now, bro. Go for more of these. I need the cripples, dude. I need to just spam way more like... Okay, this is sketchy, dude. I need way more defense. Okay, let's go like this. Like this. Just spam a ton of robos first. Full map of robos. That way we're good. Yeah, this is actually looking good. Money-wise, we're up so much. Oh, it's 10 o'clock. It's my bedtime, boys. <laughs> this defense. Soon as round 40 hits, we're going to rush. I think is the play. Thank God I brought super instead of ace, bro. Okay, let's, let's go for something here. I don't have money, though. I want to rush. Or is this just soloing? Easy. Ah, it's not easy. It kind of is, though. What? We kind of are slaying. I still have two boosts as well. I mean, he can just keep sending, but I can also just keep getting up defense. Let's go for it. Dude, I don't know. These are just going to get stronger. Let's just start sending. I think space, I think, is okay for now. The problem is so I just don't have space, dude. That's the whole problem with this map is the lack of space. I'm going to get a TT here. It'll be fine. Got a couple of these. We're going to rush here. Pretty full sendy here. He's going to counter as well. I mean, I think we're okay. There's another Tech Terry here. Okay, right, come on now. Come on, come on, come on, go, 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 go. I boost here for sure. Okay, we just have to keep sending, dude. I don't have money. Sell. Tech Terror. Sell, sell, sell. Go, 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 go. Okay, find another Tech Terror to place. Are we defending this or no? Tech Terror that, I guess. Okay, he's like all outing here. Let's cook, let's cook, let's cook. Go, 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 go. This is sketchy, bro. He just has such a better stall here. I'm just like very sussed out. Place, dude. You can't place anything on this garbage map, bro. I swear. It's impossible to place anything. We're dead. Boost. I mean, I guess I can TT micro over here. I have to keep sending. TT. TT like crazy, bro. That's the only way to win this game is if my, if my TT is... Dude, you can't place anything. You literally... I'm dead, yeah. Bro. Can't place anything. It's impossible to place on this map. It's so bad. Hitbox is terrible. See ya. Subscribe. The hitbox is... So, literally, it's impossible to place anything on this terrible map. So bad.